Conditions are set to remain tranquil over the next uh, few days. So very little is set to change. We will see a few showers coming by, but most of them should be fairly brief and it should be mostly light, maybe lasting less than half an hour or so. In terms of uh, the conditions, uh, lots of sunshine expected first thing in the morning. A few clouds will likely come across the hills, which is normal for this time of the year. But bearing in mind that uh, March is set to be wetter than normal, particularly if you're across in Trinidad. But even so, as you go through midweek, showers will be few and far between. There'll also be a bit of haze around hanging over the capital city through Port of Spain and other parts of uh, the island as well. Only a couple of showers are likely along the hillsides, but overall you will be seeing a lot of sunshine as well as uh, that uh, stiff breeze coming off the Atlantic. So temperature-wise, though, looking at highs of uh, 32 degrees Celsius in Trinidad, 30 degrees Celsius in Cane and Tobago, maybe 32 in uh, the capital of Scarborough. But in terms of uh, the next uh, few days, weather-wise, at least uh, heading out to the seas, not much is set to happen, at least in terms of the conditions, but we will be noticing some northeasterly swells beginning to push through, possibly by late on Wednesday. Could be getting those waves of two to two and a half meters through the Caribbean and the Atlantic, so be mindful about that as you go about your business with those easterly winds uh, fresh at a 20 knots, bringing some white caps and some sea spray. But the weather-wise are for Tobago through Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. You can see here the uh, sunny symbols will continue all the way through into the weekend for both Trinidad as well. We notice uh, highs of 32 degrees Celsius and lows of uh, 22 degrees Celsius. So that's a look at your weather, and that's it from me.